What up guys, this is Pastor Canario again, we're coming up with another video in C Sharp and tonight we're going to be doing some random numbers, alright? But before we start, please don't forget to like and subscribe, we're growing slowly but steady on the channel. Yeah, so we're keeping going with our C Sharp, with our Windows form. So what we, what, we'll, what we will need in here is the following. So we're going to do, we're going to get the level, Bam, level right there. We're going to get a text box, which is going to be here, text box, where are you text box? Oh, come on, dude, right there. And now we're going to need, um, hmm, this is going to be for the user input right here. And then we are going to need, um, one sec. One second, so we're going to need uh, an addition, another level, subtraction, multiplication, and division. So we're going to be doing the same thing. I think I did it on the previous video. I think I did this. But now we're going to be adding random numbers, and we're going to be adding, like, yeah, just random numbers. So we're going to be doing multiplications, adding to the number that's been produced by the user. So user puts a number and that number is going to it's going to uh, add to subtract with the random numbers that we're going to give and we're going to keep track which random number is going to be is that okay Does that make sense okay so let's do it so we we'll need that so mm, let's do this let's copy this let's copy that same let's copy that again Okay, let's go back. I like it that I copied the ball. Oh, come on, dude. So we need... I think this is too much. So we're going to get rid of this. Uh, oh, come on. Delete. One, two, three, four, yeah, okay, that's what we need. So right here we're going to, oh yeah, and then we need a button. So it's going to be a calcu calculate the button. Where are you, button? Come on, come on, bro. Button right here, boom. Okay, so the first one is going to be first number, like user input, we're going to put it. user input number okay um, pan and then this text box is going to be display user we're going to call it we're going to name it display user display user okay we have it now this one right here is going to be addition I'm going to change it right here addition and then display ads we're going to put it right here display ads For addition, then we have this one is going to be um, subtraction, subtraction, and then on the text box we're going to put display subs. Display subs. Okay. Now, right here, we're going to have multiplication. Multiplication. Pen. And right here, we're going to have display mode. Display mode. 
display mode okay pan we have it and the last one is going to be division we're going to call it text division I spell DV division pan and we're going to call it display division Dip, dips, something like that. Pain. Now, oh yeah, the button. The button is going to be what they call a calculate. What is the text? Come on, right there. Calculate, and then the, we're going to give it a name for this the design name so we can use it in our code. It's going to be. Wait, where are you? Oh, right here. <sighs> Calculate button. Cool beans. So we got it. So now we're going to to keep track uh, which which uh, random number is coming up. So we're going to do the following right here. We're going to get a bunch of levels. Two levels right here. Pan. Seven. I don't want to just keep fixing it. We're going to leave a series. Level six, levels seven, eight. Uh, like nine, then you got ten, eleven, ten, eleven, and then we got twelve. So what's going to do all of this? It's going to be something really, really cool. Okay. Let's see. Copy. Yeah, pop, yeah, pop, it's a Yeah, pop. Yeah. All right, guys. Sorry, that was my dad really quick. That was a phone call. So, okay, so now we gotta go to our calculate. Let's go over here. And bang, we have it right there. Let's work on this code right here, bro. So, should we make a little bit bigger in 200? Yeah, right there, so you can see a little bit more. Okay, right here, what we need to do is the following. So we need to create a... So we're going to create a... Um, some variables. And we're going to say a... And say a... B, C, D, oh no, just, we don't need, what I'm doing, I just need A for the first number, then I need, um, add, then I need, subtraction, Then uh, multiplication, Multipli the, they have division, and then I have, uh, we're going to create a couple, a few more of this, so let's do the same ones, four more of this, copy, And 
and then we're going to say one, two. Yeah, it's going to be it's going to be two and two. It's going to be two, 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 and two, and semicolon. Is that cool? All right. So and then we're going to use the random number right here. Let's let's do that. We're going to use the random object. Random. Random. Uh, we're going to call dimensions. Oh man, that didn't come out right. Uh, random and when, when we have operations equals new equals new random just go new random okay so now Now, right here, we're going to do the following. Um, so we have that now, right here, we're going to say for A, we're going to say equals convert that to a string. Notice to end 32 because that's what we need. And then open semi uh, open parentheses and then we're going to say display. And right here we're going to display oh man display first. Display user. Yeah. Display user. Semicolon. Now, right here, we're going to use our add. Okay. For the first one, we're going to say add one equals. Oh, we do have that one. It's add two equals to uh, operation that next open and close the parentheses semicolon and we want from one number to a hundred so that's going to be what we're going to be working on okay so right here now what we need right here is the level so what level do we need so the level is going to be six right because that's what we have right here level six right here okay uh, let's see text Okay, uh, right here we need, no actually, so we still got to work on our add, we're going to add this, so add equals add two, we get add two, and um, we're going to say plus A. So that's what we have right there. So then right here on the bottom, we're going to say level, level six, that text, equals we're going to say the string, we're going to say the random number is the 
the random number is and pan we finish that in there and then we're going to do we're going to make a color for level seven because that's what we have the random number right seven level seven that four color four color equals that system that drawing drawing that color that we're going to do red okay so and then so it's going to be the color and then we're going to say level seven level seven that text equals we're going to say add add to that to a string oh come on dude give me a break give me a break man okay so let's just try this one let's see what it's, let's execute this okay so let's just get a number of two okay let's calculate okay so the random number is 33 but it didn't give us the addition hmm. let's go back over here and check what happened so it's supposed to be 35 right because that's what because we're adding so let's see um So I'll just checking my code. Uh, two. Because that's the random number right here, and we're passing add. Oh, 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 yeah. What the heck is wrong with me, dude? What the heck is wrong with me? So I need, I was forgetting the most important thing over here. What the heck is it, the name of the. Um, or the text box what is it what did I say for the name uh, let's see display ads so it's not printing anywhere display display ads that text equals to add add that to a string oh come on man you kidding me bro okay now it should give us let's see so let's do two let's run it okay the random number is 58 now it's 58 right plus two is 60 so that gives us a 60 so let's run it again Run the number is 21. I mean, I mean, the, the addition is 21. It's 21 total because the random number is 19. Plus 2 is 21. Okay, it is, it's adding. So let's calculate again. So now the random number is 59. Plus 2, that's 61. Let's do it again. Now it's 33 plus 2 is 35. One more time. 27. Okay. That's working as we expected. So now what we do for the other ones, we're going to do almost like similar. So we're going to copy and paste all of this code. So we can do the same thing for... So this is going to, what is the second one? Uh, subtraction. Sub. 
so let's just do what do we do right here subs but we have subs too okay so we're going to change subs is that subs you yeah subs you subs you and then we're going to add sub is that sub subs for subtra subtraction and then we're going to say right here subs subs to minus and then run the numbers it's still the same here's the same and then we're going to have pass subs to right here subs to and then we're going to do the same thing with multiplication and division So next one is going to be, what is it, a multiplication. Do we did mal2, yeah, mal2. So we're just going to do mal for multiplication. Right here we're going to change that to mal. And right here we'll say mal. And then we're going to multiplication run the number is ta, 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 and then right here we're going to do mal2 okay oh no did I put it the wrong one okay Okay, now we're going to do division. We're going to say div. Did you say div or dips? I said div two, and then I said dip just for that. Div. I can say div two. Okay. And then we have, oh yeah, we got to change the labels too. So it's going to be div2. Okay, now over here we got to change the label. So let's just do control D so we, do, we have this ready. Okay, so display ads, this is going to be display what do we display mult display sub what do we do display sub oh man let's just do this display subs okay so what about this next one display mult and it's going to be Mod. and then this last one display display dips for division and then right here we're going to say um div okay that should work but we gotta change these levels right here it's going to be six seven it's going to be eight and nine and nine, say eight, nine, nine. It's going to be ten and eleven, eleven. I think so. Is that eleven? Wait. so confusing over here wait I'm confused now what the heck so six seven seven let's just go back over here six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen okay six seven 
for addition, 8, 9 for subtraction, eight, nine, ten, and eleven, twelve and thirteen. Twelve and thirteen and thirteen. So let's see. Let's see if this doesn't give us any trouble. Let's execute this program and see what we have. So let's just do two again. Okay. Let's, let's see if this is right. So, the is 2, right? The random number is 89. 89 plus 2 is 91. That's, that's correct. Now, the random number for the subtraction is 29. Minus 2 is 27, which is good. Now, multiplication random number is 93 times 2 3 times 2 is 6 9 times 2 is 18 186 that, that's correct so now division number number so random number is 3 um, divided by 2 yeah it's going to give you the 1 yeah that's correct so that worked all right, so that worked as expected, guys. Random number. So hopefully this video helped you out. So don't forget to like and subscribe. We're going to keep pumping up more videos man, every single day. So we'll see. I mean, that's the goal. All right. Have a good night, and I will talk to you in the next video. We're going to be doing a lot more deep stuff with with the Windows Form and, and, and other programs too, other applications. All right. Have a good night. I will see you later. Bye-bye.